how to solve for the value of x that satisfies this given equation. Let's see what we can do. Here, we can write 9 as a square of 3. So, 3 square power x minus 6 can be written as a product of 2 and 3. So, 2 multiplied by 3 power x is equal to and 4 here can be written as a square of 2. So, 2 square whole power x. Now, uh, before we proceed ahead, there are two things to notice here. The first thing is about the first term. Here, this is in the form of a power b whole power c. This can also be written as a power c whole power b. This is the first thing. And the second thing is about the second term. This is in the form of a multiplied by b whole power c. This can also be written as a power c multiplied by b power c. So now if we apply these properties in the equation above then we will have 3 power x whole square minus 2 power x multiplied by 3 power x is equal to 2 power x whole square. Now let's divide this equation by 3 power x whole square then this will give us 3 power x whole square over 3 power x whole square minus 2 power x multiplied by 3 power x over 3 power x whole square is equal to 2 power x square over 3 power x square. This and this will cancel out. 3 power x and 3 power x will cancel out. And this will give us 1 minus 2 power x over 3 power x is equal to 2 power x over 3 power x whole square. Now let us say that y is equal to 2 power x over 3 power x. And now if we replace this value in this equation, then we will have 1 minus y is equal to y square. So now we have the equation 1 minus y is equal to y square. On subtracting 1 minus y on both sides, we will have y square plus y minus 1 is equal to 0. And this is a quadratic equation in y. So we can use the quadratic formula to calculate the value of y y will be equal to minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac over 2a. This gives us minus 1 plus minus under root 5 over 2. So there are two possible values for y. y is equal to minus 1 plus root 5 over 2 or y is equal to minus 1 minus root 5 over 2. We had assumed that y is equal to 2 power x over 3 power x and this regardless of the value of x will always give us a positive value. But in this possibility where y is equal to minus 1 minus root 5 over 2, y will be a negative value and this does not satisfy our observation so that we can neglect this possibility and go with y is equal to minus 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then we will have 2 power x over 3 power x equal to minus 1 plus root 5 over 2. Now this can be written as 2 by 3 whole power x equal to minus 1 plus root 5 over 2. Now let's apply log on both sides. So applying log on both sides we will have log 2 over 3 power x is equal to log minus 1 plus root 5 over 2. This can be written as x log 2 over 3 equal to log minus 1 plus root 5 over 2. From here we can, we can get x is equal to log minus 1 plus root 5 over 2 divided by log 2 over 3. And this is approximately equal to 1.186 and that's our answer.